the Simpson family visiting a new museum in Springfield, which features a time machine exhibit. Bart becomes fascinated with the time machine and, after sneaking away from the rest of the family, decides to take it for a spin. He ends up traveling back in time to the year 1969, where he meets a young Homer and Marge. Bart is thrilled to meet his parents as teenagers, but realizes that he needs to be careful not to disrupt their past or he could alter the course of his own future. He decides to follow them around town and observe their behavior, hoping to learn something new about them. Along the way, he also meets a teenage Seymour Skinner and a young Ned Flanders. As the day goes on, Bart becomes increasingly worried about altering the past, especially when he sees a teenage Homer getting into trouble with the law. He eventually intervenes to help Homer out, but accidentally causes a chain reaction of events that drastically alter the future. When he returns to the present day, he discovers that Springfield is now a completely different place, and the Simpsons family is completely unrecognizable. Bart tries to figure out a way to set things right, and decides that he needs to travel back in time once more to fix his mistake. This time, he's more careful to avoid changing anything significant, and manages to prevent the chain reaction from occurring. He returns to the present day to find that everything is back to normal, and that his family is just as he remembered them. Urge for taking the time machine without permission. Bart promises never to do it again.